Hey there, it is E Squared Photography. I am Emily, Erin is not here with us today, but I am super excited about today's YouTube video. We are talking all about Imagine AI, and if you have no idea what Imagine AI is, you are missing out, and this video is going to clear it all up for you. But the reason we are so excited about this video today is because Imagine AI has quite literally saved us so much time in our photography business with editing that we cannot believe we wish we would have had this years ago when we did weddings all the time, but it is here, it is here to stay, and it has been absolutely fabulous for us and for our business. So we're gonna talk all about that today. And if you are brand new to our channel, please make sure to subscribe and hit that bell for notifications of future videos. And by the end of this video, we promise you are going to be on board. You're going to be just as excited as us and you are going to start saving time immediately. And make sure to stick around until the end because we have something you are going to love. Okay, so let's jump in. So first things first, what is AI? You keep hearing the word AI. So it's called it's artificial intelligence. And AI is basically like giving the computer the ability to learn from experience. They can understand words, recognize images, and help solve problems, making them useful tools in our daily lives. And over time, they get better at these tasks. An AI in photography workflow can be incredibly helpful streamlining the process of enhancing the quality of your photos. It makes the process more efficient and personalized, allowing photographers to achieve the high quality results with less manual effort. So what this is saying is when you are using AI, imagine AI to edit your images, it is learning how you like to your images edit. Each time it edits for you and you make minor changes, it continues to learn along the way. It continues to learn if you shift your editing style. It learns with you and makes those changes for you. All right, so you might be thinking right now, oh, it's just another thing that I have to figure out how to use. I don't wanna waste my time trying to figure it out. Well, you are wrong, I would like to say. So just because you don't want to change doesn't mean change isn't happening anyway. It's here, it's happening. We do need to start to learn how to use it in many ways in the photography industry, but one being for editing. So if this is how you feel, maybe you think this is what it's going to look like while you're trying to use Imagine AI, we promise you it is not. It is super, super easy to use with plenty of tutorials and understandings of how to use it. Okay, so let's talk about Imagine AI and what it can do for your business. So it is AI culling, AI editing, and cloud storage. There's a lots of things you can use within it and we love them all. So the culling portion of it, imagine leverages AI to simplify the culling phase for a photographer's workflow. It removes duplicate images, blinks, blurry results, or photos with poor composition, all within the software. And again, it learns with you. It learns what you, what images you maybe like to keep and what you don't like to keep as well. It also does editing. And this is obviously our favorite part of Imagine, but it uses your own editing style to batch edit your images very, very quickly. And it has features like cropping, straightening, smoothing skin, and subject masking so you can get through your workflow very quickly. And then it also has storage. So it backs up your images and takes up to one fourth the amount of space than your external hard drive would, which is super amazing. So comment below which one of those really stands out to you that could save you tons of time or just a sense of relief knowing your images are backed up. Again, like we said, we are big into the editing portion of it. Love it all, but the editing is huge for us. Okay, so how do you get started with this whole Imagine AI editing? How does it all work? How does it understand the way you like to edit? Well, there are five ways to get started with editing. The very first one is a very classic personalized profile. This is actually what we did since we started using Imagine right away. This was one of the only options they had and it worked really, really well for us. Uh, but you can upload 3000 images, which sounds like a lot, but it's not as many as you actually think. 
um, and train your profile, your imagined profile, so that it edits just like you would. So really past images of galleries that you really love, you could upload those and it's going to learn with you. The second one is called a light profile. So you don't have to have the 3000 images. You can upload your favorite preset that you like to use and get started training your AI profile that way. So that's another option to do. Or number three, there are talent profiles. So Imagine actually has profiles built in that you can use to apply to your gallery and see what you think, which is super nice as well. Number four is shared profiles from Imaginers. And with this, if you have some sort of team that you're working with, you can actually share your profile amongst the team. And then number five, you can purchase profiles from others. So we actually have our own Imagine profile that you can purchase. And um, in the description below, we have a discount code. So you'll have to check that out for 50% off, but you can purchase that and you can use that in Imagine. And that's kind of like your own little preset that you're starting to use with, but it's way better than a preset because it learns as you tweak things inside Lightroom. And if at this point you're like, okay, how does it work with Lightroom? I don't understand. Basically all you do is you upload your raw images into Lightroom and then you upload that whole Lightroom gallery into Imagine. Imagine does its magic and then it opens right back up into Lightroom, Lightroom Classic with your edits. It's so incredibly amazing. And you can make something called profile adjustments which is an advanced feature that allows adjusting the results you get back from the AI profile you're using. So if you use it for the very first time and your images that you get come out a little too, let's say too blue, you can make that adjustment right in Imagine to warm your images back up and then it can re-edit that gallery. That doesn't happen very often that you need to use that though because Imagine seriously gets it spot on with the editing and learns when you make those changes inside of editing. The second piece that, it, you, that Imagine has is smooth skin. This feature is absolutely amazing. We use it on a lot of our senior girls just to give a little bit of a softened skin. So that's a super, super handy tool that they have. Then we don't have to apply it inside of Lightroom. It just applies it to the images as it's editing inside Imagine for us. Another feature which can be super amazing is subject mask. And this setting is a feature designed to provide complete control over the result obtained from the Imagine subject mask AI tool. So you can actually mask your subject and make tweaks to that inside of Imagine. We haven't dabbled with that too much, but I know a lot of photographers, that is their favorite piece of Imagine. Another feature which we use on basically everything that we shoot is the crop and straighten. So if you are sick and tired of straightening every single image, you can actually check, just check a little box inside of Imagine saying you want all of your images straightened, it will straighten all of your images. If you want them to crop your images for you, you can do that as well. We use both, we love both. So what used to take us days now takes us less than 15 minutes. Efficiency is something that we highly value, especially when it comes to our business. And efficiency is why we're obsessed with Imagine and we cannot promote it enough because it, it really does. It saves you so much time. Comment below and let us know which one of those features you are most excited about. I think I really love the softened skin and the straightening. Those are probably my two favorite features that Imagine has that I use on basically everything. Now, like I said, inside of the Imagine software, there are plenty of tutorials. It's super easy to use, but Imagine does have its own YouTube channel as well. And you can even check that out before committing to using Imagine. It is a great resource. Now, like I said, we have something special just for you. So number one, Imagine is super, super reasonably priced. So it is well worth your time well worth the money 
you can just up your session fee a little extra 10 bucks and you are paying for your Imagine Edits. But if you wanna try it for free before committing, we have 1,500 free edits for you. You can just scan the QR code right here and that will pop open the link to um, open it up or you can find it in the description below as well. And like I said, we have our own Imagine profile. So if you are interested in it, we have a 50% off code, E squared 50, and you can just pause the video right here and you can take a look at it. You can even try it on your images. And this little gift here describes perfectly what Imagine can do for you and your business. Now, I hope that that was helpful, but go ahead and leave any questions you have in the comments and I will get back to those as soon as I can. And if you like this video, make sure to subscribe and check out the links in the description below to get the free edits, to look at our profile and get started saving tons of time with Imagine today. And we will see you next time.